Hi, in this tutorial, I'll talk about very interesting topic. You can name it either sling mapping, resource resolution or URL rewriting. And we will achieve this concept using ETC mapping as part of this tutorial. So before we move on, let's understand what I'm trying to say. What is this sling mapping? So in a typical AEM website, you have a client, then we have a web server. It can be Apache or IIS and then we have AEM. So when any request comes in, let's say a request is coming for this domain. Now, this request doesn't know which content to be served for this request. So we can add this information either at web server, but as part of this tutorial, we are not going to do that. Once the request comes in, this AEM server should know what content should be returned for the this request means now we have only and only domain so there must be some configuration which says okay return this content return this page and this content will be returned back to end user or the client one more thing you will notice here our pages are at this path starting from content and but end sites means my domain doesn't have this path and ideally they shouldn't have so the domain should have some short path let's understand one more scenario i have again a request with with one page or some url with the domain so what happened either on my Apache, I can add this information or I can tell which content to be served for this. But we are going to achieve this using only and only AEM. So again, that request comes into my AEM. Now, my AEM should know which page should be served or which content should be served for this request. Okay, I know this, this there is a page called men, but this page is under slash content, we retail US, EN and men. So how I should know means how this content means this thing should be mapped to this page. So this is called sling either sling mapping resource resolution or URL rewriting. What do you mean by URL rewriting instead of whole path? I'm just hiding this and I will show only this path in my URL means after domain I will have this and I will return the content of this page to end user. So this thing we are going to achieve using ETC mappings. So as I said, we are going to achieve using ETC mapping, but what other options we have for this sling mapping or resource resolution? So there are four ways. One is root level mapping. This root level mapping is achieved using ETC mappings. Then alias configuration, vanity path configuration, and there's a one more called namespace, but we are not going to uh, talk about this generally in custom projects we are not use this so as part of this tutorial i'll talk about the first one and later on in another tutorial i'll talk about these two okay so when we talk about etc mappings or root level mappings what you must understand these mappings are stored under etc map you can create your own folder but that folder should be uh, used in this configuration so as part of this, what we should know, ETC mappings, and there is a configuration, OSGI configuration, resource is all our factory configuration. And there are four properties, those are really important, and we will be using this. One is sling match, sling internal redirect, sling redirect, and sling status. So as part of this tutorial, I'll use these two properties in this tutorial. As I'll be using the sling match and sling internal redirect properties, let's understand the use of these properties. You won't understand by definition, but let me read it for you. This property when set on a resource in the ETC map tree, in ETC map tree defines a particular regular expression, partial regular expression, which is used instead of resource name to match incoming request this line is important but you won't understand what i'm trying to say now you will understand this line when we will have demo so this property can be used instead of resource name right so there is something called resource name which is being used but if we can't use resource name then this property is used so that this thing you will understand by demo now the one is internal redirect. This property when set on resource in ETC map tree cause the current path 
to be modified internally to continue resource resolution this is a multi level property so this property is used to resolve your resource what re request comes in from domain for a particular resource that resource will be resolved using this property internally it won't change your url okay this will resolve internally and this is a multi level multi valued property you will understand in demo these two properties are really important so there are two type of properties or two type of configuration conceptually this is important for your interviews and you will understand this by demo one is sling mapping we used to call it sling mapping or forward mapping forward mapping is not a standard term but to differentiate this from others sometimes i used to call it forward mapping so you won't find forward mapping in any documentation another one is reverse mapping right so what is the difference between these two these are just conceptually difference how you will create configuration that is same for both when you map your url from request to resource means when you map your request url to resource that is called forward mapping but when you map your existing resource to a url that is called reverse mapping we will understand this by demo this is really important topic for your interviews so as part of this tutorial we'll see how you can add a configuration for root folder how you can shorten your url using etc mappings and we'll create the custom url and we'll again see reverse mapping and we'll understand this so as part of this tutorial we'll have two domain obviously which is locally set up ca.vretail.local and us.vretail.local those domains will be referring to us and canadian english sites so now let's get into demo so if you don't have locally set up uh, dispatcher or apache server don't worry about it you only consider here you have some domain here so let's say what happened when you hit a publish instance by default there is a page which comes up and generally this is we retail us en page so let's say i have to locally set up domain this is for us when i hit this so this by default page is coming up even if i hit this us or let's say i hit this us or canadian side either one the same page is coming up and this page is coming up which is the default page whenever you hit my publish server so first what what configuration i should add here so that it hit my home page before that let's see how you can create actually these configurations so inside etc you have a folder called map you can create your own folder this can be a sling uh, sling folder or simply empty folder in your project if you are already in any of the project you will see a different run modes added to these folders like publish publish dev publish local publish uat but ideally these mappings or these folder doesn't support run mode then why we add multiple because we have to maintain these configuration for different instances so for each instance what you will do you will create a instance of resource resolver factory so let's say i want to up, uh, use this folder for my this local so what i'll do i'll go to this osgi configuration and search for this configuration resource resolver factory here i will be defining the path of the map folder which i suppose to use on this instance in your case if you are already on project so you will be having this configuration for each run mode and each run mode you will be defining a particular folder path here so in our case this is the folder so all the configuration what i will be writing i will be writing here in map.publish.local right you can have simply map or you can have any name here under this you will create a folder or two folder http or https this is for what kind of the either you can have http or https what kind of your domain is running upon so i am on local so i will be creating an http only so what happened i'll create here a node of sling mapping type so let me create that node first okay so you will see here i created a node and my node name is exactly same what my domain is so if you see this is the same as per my domain for us here and this node will be of sling mapping type this is specific type you should have 
here then I add a property called internal redirect and I added this here okay this one so what I'll do for now let me do it like this HTML okay I did not use sling match property here why if you read that line properly it says if resource name is not match that means what I'm saying this is my resource and my domain is exactly matching with this so if my domain is exactly matching with this now that request understand this is the node they should take about okay here what I'm saying when any request comes in here map that request or resolve that request at this path okay so let me save it first one disclaimer here if you add these things or if you make these changes in CRXD those things sometimes don't work because the resolution won't work your factory won't refresh so in that case what you have to do ideally what I say make all your changes at once and restart your local instance okay or you just open this resource resolution factory configuration and just save it once so that it refresh in actual environment that issue won't come up because you will be deploying this using code or using build in that case your bundle will be refreshed okay so let me save it first here and let me add a one more configuration for us let's copy paste it here so i have created uh, for one for the canadian site and one for the us site and i respectively added home page for both if you see here this is my us and this is canadian so what happened earlier when i was hitting either us site or canadian site it was going to the default page now let me open this now let me open this now okay you will see no url here no page url here but something else is break my page is not working properly but it is landed to my home page right let me uh, hit the us as well here right again this is also broken but it's going to the right page what is the reason of this broken because i added a etc mapping internally that is resolving to my page but what is happening now my client lips are not resolving so you can add one configuration for your client lips again this is a disclaimer when you add internal this etc mappings and you add some mapping that could break something else right so you have to be careful what you're supposed to add and what this your rule is resolving so now my rule is what i'm saying because i added at a domain and i'm only resolving this so there other stuff which is loading based on domain that could break because i don't have any rule for it so what i'll do now it's moving right it's moving to this page so for to add client library to resolve client library what i have done i created a one more node here one more node of the same type let's say this one if you see here this etc underscore client lives this is under my upper node means up, the node which i created with a domain name so you will see here what's happening here so now i added a property why because this node is not same as my domain so my this node won't be identified using resource name means this node won't be identified using domain because the domain name is different and this node name is different so when node name is different then you have to use this property and this was the purpose to show you why you should use sling match so what happened now sling match now you see two things sling match and sling internal redirect internal redirect i was using earlier so what happened these two properties are important here let's say sling match right so so whatever you add in sling match that is called pattern or regex so what happened what this mean this one right so it says after domain if anything comes like this that should be that should be resolved here so there are two things you will see here you will see a plus sign here right this plus sign right let me clean this up first this plus sign this is a regex what it says dot plus means one or more so whenever this kind of patterns comes and after this 
etc dot client labs if anything comes up any character one or more comes up resolve that in this pattern resolve that like slash etc client labs and you will see dollar one dollar one is a variable always consider this okay this is important because you will see a lot of stuff like this so what this rule is saying whenever anything comes after client lib etc dot client lib if any character comes in store that character in this variable okay so whatever will come here after this that will store in this variable so how it will resolve anything that comes etc client lib after that it will be resolved like domain then slash etc dot client lib and then whatever comes here so how client lips are resolved domain slash etc dot client lips and whatever the name of client lib here so this rule is resolving a client lips and that's the purpose of sling matching when your node name doesn't match with your request or i would say domain so now you understand forward so if you see here this my first rule says when this request comes in internally redirect to this resource so this is called forward mapping when resource means request to resource this is my request this is my resource same thing if you see in etc also what i'm saying whenever any request comes in for this resolve this to this client lib so this is called forward mapping i'll show you example of reverse mapping as well for now what i'll do because i need to add multiple rules so what i'll do for this home page rule i'll create a separate rule and you will understand the sling match as well inside this i'll add other rules so what happened as i already explained whatever rule you added inside this what this sling match will does start from domain and then this pattern this will resolve like this okay so let me add other rules and i will modify so what i'll do to shorten my url now i'll create a internal redirect and then i'll other rule also i'll add under this and for the home page specific i'll rule is i will write a separate rule so now you will see here i added a additional rule you will say us vdt underscore local underscore home so now this rule will be used only for the home means when the domain comes in so what i'm saying here sling match why sling match because this resource is not mapping with the name so i'm saying if this request slash this dollar dollar means end of the string if you know regex this means end of the string so if this comes internally redirect or resolve to this path so whenever you hit domain it will resolve using this rule now for the other rules same thing here i added two stuff here now you will see in internal redirect if you see there is a multiple property multi valued property so i added two things here slash we retail us en and slash what does that mean so whenever any request comes in after this domain let's say domain and slash abc so that abc will be resolved under this path or this path so it will check both paths right so it will check it will add let's say it's men dot html so it will add here men dot html it resolve no then it will go to this path and it will say this path slash men dot html whether that is resolved yes then it will reverse that you know return that content you can add multiple paths or you can add few more paths so whenever for any path if resource is resolved that response is sent back to client so what is happening here so you understood this rule okay and again this is a forward mapping reason being you know the request let's say domain plus request and you are trying to map with your resource so that is called forward as i said so let me come back here and let me refresh this right so using this it is coming on the home page right it is canadian home page you will see that this symbol icon here and you will see i updated the content as well to show you this is uh, canadian and if i refresh this it should be us you see this little icon here country icon here right and you see this us home page so now 
using this rules these rules this is moving to my home page now using this rule right what i mean let's say if i say here say m e n or let's say women dot html i'm not adding a complete path and i hit that this page is resolved so how it is resolved at is as i explain here in this this is for us so it will come here it will check this after domain part it will map resolve using this path or this path whenever it will resolve it will return so using this it will resolve it added like what happened it added after this and it added woman here dynamically and this is resolved so that resource is request is resolved so whenever any short request comes in means any request comes in it resolve my rewriting is working fine but there is a one problem here when i over this means i will never type every time i will never type women i never type community product anything here i will go using my links and if you see over any link you will notice the bottom here bottom left you will see there is a complete path happening here when i click it is going to my whole path right whenever i click let's say here the whole path right so these link should be resolved now when i resolve these links mean these resources back to my domain that is called reverse mapping and how i am going to do that let me explain so these links should be resolved these links will be shortened means now my link rewrite url shortening should be happening here okay not link rewriting that is a different thing so now you will see this rule here i just added a rule reverse hyphen html so whatever you can name it anything right because i am adding sling match so what i am saying here sling internal redirect sling internal redirect what i am saying my path us en slash dot asterisk so now you will see here and the variable is in my sling match now you will see my pattern is my internal redirect okay and my variable is in my match sling match so what happened what it will say whenever you find anything like this replace with this one so what happened let's say i have slash content v retail slash us slash en and then slash man.html so the part man.html will become here right you will see here in this variable so this is called reverse mapping i am mapping my existing page to a shorthand url that is called reverse mapping and you will see a difference here in forward mapping pattern is in my sling match but in reverse mapping pattern in my internal redirect this is very confusing because we use same rule you won't understand this but here very simple rules you can understand there one exception for it i will explain that end but when your pattern is in internal redirect in that case most probably it is reverse mapping okay and when your pattern is in match that is called forward mapping right you will see this variable and map map this pattern pattern is that means dot strict means zero or more this is simple regex so what should happen now my page here means all the link should be shortened now if i hover now you will see this bottom left now instead of complete path it is slash experience slash man and even i hit that so see this now it's happening it's going here so in the combination of these rules this is working properly and even hit this okay so this was not working because of cache this page was cached earlier now if i refresh so it's completely working fine even equipment it's completely working fine so these rules you will see here this is my reverse mapping so now all the links are working properly we have set up forward mapping we have set up reverse mapping we we, we shorten this urls means we shorten the path of pages now home page link so you will see there is a home page link and when i hover this it's if you notice bottom left it is going to my domain right and even if i hit domain let's say i hit domain so it it's going to my domain so this when i hit this 
this is going to my domain using forward mapping and this link is resolved when I hover this this link is resolved to my domain means this resource is means which is the en page which is resolving to my domain which is my reverse mapping so here is a one exception now you will see but I wrote only one rule for it right you will see this rule right so what's happening here so this rule sometimes can be used for a forward mapping as well as reverse mapping you got it forward mapping as well as reverse mapping so in nutshell what you can understand this is exception one rule which doesn't have any regex okay which have any pattern that rule could be used for forward and backward mapping forward and reverse mapping okay so this is the example how a single rule is used for the forward mapping and reverse mapping let's understand what happened if i remove the specific rule so this is my ca domain canadian if i hit that it's going perfectly to my home page right you see this icon here little icon here and here it's my canadi this domain now let me remove this one okay let me remove this one so i have removed that rule and now let me hit my canadian site okay this is not going anywhere because now it doesn't know which content to be served because i removed that home page rule right but it know how to serve other pages let me go to man.html it loaded right but if i still go here on this home icon you will see the complete path is showing here now it's not reverse mapping now it's not adding reverse mapping because this icon or has the complete path so you see at left bottom the complete path is showing here so now in such cases same rule can be used for forward mapping as well as reverse mapping so you understood this this is really good interview question if your interviewer asked this so this was just basic to make you understand how you should write these rules and how these rules work what is the sling mapping means forward mapping what is reverse mapping so i would advise only add all your rules and just restart your local instance if you are doing using crxd so sometimes you won't see your changes until either you refresh your factory resource resolver factory or restart instance i hope you understood if you have any question add your comment Thank you.